So in this video I'm going to talk about the confirmed team of the year that we are going to get in FIFA on Ball 22 as well as the new leagues for today's National Heroes players or cards as well as the team of the week cards and some icons, event icons, prime icons. So make sure to like and subscribe if you are excited for it. This is the confirmed team of the year that is going to come out in FIFA on Ball then. Uh, obviously it's not going to come out in FIFA on Ball just yet, it's going to take a few weeks or so but um, in FIFA 20, on FIFA 23 on console version we, uh, we we already know which players are coming out and obviously we are going to get the exact same team of the year players in FIFA Mobile as well so it's guaranteed that we are getting these team of the year players so in goal we've got Courtois I think that's quite deserved it, it was quite split with Courtois and Demi Martinez but throughout the year I think Courtois has been a better player better, better goalkeeper even though I like Martinez a lot more then we got Hakimi at right back position um, quite deserved as well, right? He had a great World Cup with Morocco and he played he played quite well for PSG as well. We got Van Dijk as well. Van Dijk, like, he, he, did a decent, he had a decent year, but yeah, I think he got it mostly because he's Van Dijk. I don't really think he's, he really had that great of a year. Anyways, then we got Eden Militao. There was no Rudiger, there was no Alaba. Uh, in the votes for Real Madrid, so and one of the one of the centre backs should have got a card from Real Madrid. I don't think Eder Militao really deserves to be in the team of the year. I don't really think he was like the best uh, the best centre back this year. Far from it, but it is what it is. I think yeah, it's, it's all right that he got a card. We got Hernandez at left back. That's that's quite deserved because there are not that many great left backs. We've got Bellingham is, as one of the midfielders. Obviously had a great year. Quite deserved, I would say. Played very, very well with Dortmund. And in the World Cup, he was one of the best players for um, England, if not, if not the best. So, yeah, not not bad. Modric, obviously, 37 years old. Still going so, so strong. And 100% deserved. He, he had a great World Cup. He obviously won the Champions League with Real Madrid as well. 100% deserves that. We've got De Bruyne as well. Once again, with Van Dijk. Like, De Bruyne had a great year. But you can't, you can't not have him in the team of the year, right? Even though he didn't have as good of a year as one of the, uh, as like a couple of years ago or last year even, you still have to have uh, Van Dijk and uh, De Bruyne in the team of the year, I think. Uh, and then up front, we've got Mbappe, 100% deserved. Had a great World Cup, played well for PSG. Uh, Messi, obviously Messi was going to get a card with uh, winning the World Cup as well. Incredible run in the World Cup, best player of the tournament as well. Mbappe got the top scorer and Benzema at striker position, won the Champions League, was the best player in the Champions League. Didn't play in the World Cup because of the because of an injury, I think. Uh, and then because he fell out with some of the players and the coach, I believe at least. And yeah, but yeah, still still won the ballon d'or. Definitely deserves to get a uh, get a team on the air card. Let me know down in the comment section if you agree with every single of these positions. I might disagree with some of them, for example, with Eder Militao. Like, Eder Militao obviously had a great, had a good Champions League run, but don't think he's, the, he's like one of the best central backs in the world. Definitely don't think that. And uh, Bellingham, even though I, I really, really like Bellingham, but I think Valverde might might have got an edge uh, to Bellingham as well. I don't know. Still, I'm, I'm happy with Bellingham. Anyways, yeah, that's the team of the year then. So first of all, event icon leaks for the National Heroes event and we are getting two two icons. We are getting Larson and Maldini and I did say that we are probably going to get either either Larson or Puskas and we are getting Larson. They are both, I think, are going to be 107 overall. And yeah, let me know which one you are excited for the most. I think most people are excited for Maldini. Hopefully he's going to get a central back card and not a last back card. Obviously he played as a last back um, as well in his earlier earlier years. But hopefully he's gonna get a center back card, and Larson is gonna get a striker a striker card probably. Larson is gonna be a good card, but I think Maldini as a central back is gonna be a real deal, and I think they're gonna come out in the exchanges as well, at least one of them. So Maldini might come out in the exchanges. We don't know right now. Here are the national hero player leagues. Then we are getting uh, Chiesa, as, as you can see, Federico Chiesa from Juventus, as well as Sinchenko from uh, Man, uh, no Man City anymore from Arsenal. We are getting Ibrahimovic from Milan and uh, Sweden. We're getting Holosek. I don't actually know that guy, but we're getting him as well. McTominay from Man United and Scotland. We are getting Davis. We are getting Robertson as well. Uh, Odegaard from Norway. Uh, Wober, as well as Barella. Uh, Di Lorenzo. 
another Kia and uh, Ibrahimovic cards as well as Robertson. So those three cards are probably gonna be the giveaway cards. Uh, so yeah, let me know which one you're excited for the most. We got some more National Heroes League players than some more National Hero players that we are gonna get. Here we've got Olsen as well as the goalkeeper. I think he plays for one of the Italian. I think Roma is. Does he play for Roma anymore? Then we've got Solo as well. We've got uh, Berg. We've got Kral, Hendrik, Marin. Kar uh, I don't know most of these guys, by the way. We got Karavayev from Ukraine, I think. McLean, Matvienko, um, as well as Gregorich, and some others. As I said, I can't really pronounce these names that well. Um, and I, I don't, I don't even know most of these cards from these, from these players. I know Olsen, Sorloth, and I know Matvienko and Gregorich and, and Shalai. I don't know Shalai as well. Other than that, I don't know any other cards, but they are going to get a national heroes, some national heroes card. So yeah. And here are the team of the week leaks as well. Uh, we are in the new team of the week. We are going to get Joselu Kolasinac. I think he used to play for Arsenal as well. He plays for Marseille right now. Um, Gal uh, Galene, Galen, we're gonna get Thiago Silva from Chelsea, Dybala as well, Traore, uh, I think Traore beat, uh, Traore scored the goal against PSG and they beat, uh, beat PSG, we got Ramsdale, Ward Prowse, Rashford who's playing incredibly well right now, Ossiman, same thing, he's playing well, uh, David, Jonathan David from Lille, we've got Pepe Reina, used to play for Liverpool, uh, we've got uh, Lejean as well, Lukman, and Robert Ton. These were uh, these are gonna be the new team of the week players. Then I'm gonna open these packs actually to end the video on. I'm gonna open these packs to end the video on. Let's see what I'm gonna pack. I've got uh, I've got six point thirty five percent chance to pack somebody great from this one. Okay, we've got we've got sixty five overall player. Let's see the quest as well. I want to complete the weekly quest, of course. Uh, for the weekly quest, I need to open six more times and open national matches packed in national matches chapter four more times so i need to open this four more times so i need to at least open one of these i'm gonna open this right now then i'm gonna open this right now let's see we've got 83 overall Hradecki. okay right uh, uh this pack again can we pick a walkout no walkout unfortunately we, we did pack some skill boost so i'll take skill boost and i'm gonna open one of these and the one 1000 one again and in the video there, 200,000 coins, and this one, and let's see, no walkout, 100,000 coins from this, so no luck from this at all, no luck from this at all, let's go ahead and open that pack then as well, I'm gonna open this one, I don't want to open the other one of course, and see what we're gonna get, we've got 66 overall Liu Yang, okay then, this is gonna be the end of the video guys for today, please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it, and peace.